Once you've involved yourself with the sea, it's, it's always with you. The sea gets into your blood somehow. Cox Power Train has been something deep in me for a long, long time. The spark for it was undoubtedly a fire which I caused on the back of my mother's boat. I had spilt petrol and it caught fire. It was lit by a Calagas powered fridge. I was very lucky to escape. It left an enduring thought in my mind that nobody wants a volatile fuel on board a boat. That was when the idea started in my head. It was driven by safety. It was very obvious to me that the market needed a diesel outboard and has needed it for decades and nobody had done it. And there was a reason for that. It is very difficult to do. The key was to get the technology right to deliver the product that the market needed. And what we set out to do was to create a diesel outboard that was as closely equivalent to a petrol outboard as possible. So David Cox is a very interesting man. So what happened was that I was in a small investment bank at the time and, and this project kept coming in front of me. The claims that were being made seemed to me to be pretty outstanding. The weight of the engine and the technology seemed to be a little bit too good to be true. When I met the man, I found somebody who actually had been innovating most of his life. In the work he had done, I saw the opportunity for outboard motors. The thinking behind it was, how do you take weight out of an engine? Formula One is no better place to look. You know, they spend a vast amount of money taking weight out of uh, engines. And the UK uh, is one of the centers of excellence for that activity. So the meeting with David and really understanding that we have that technology, the ability to bring that technology to a diesel outboard solution was the light bulb moment for me.